I've got one more gift for you. Oh, okay. This is, uh, I think, might be a Top Trumps game. Whatever it is, it hangs from a stick on one of those carousels in yeah, the shop. It does. Gonna but you can get some now. pretty amazing things hanging, hanging from, from carousels. It's true. Oh, look at this. It's a piece of electronics. It's called an I Hear 3 Bluetooth 4.0 Key Finder. Key Finder. So if I lose my keys... Or anything. Or anything. Doesn't have to be keys. That's very good. I can find it. You can attach it to your wink wonk if you like. My mind. Your mind. Um, it's good. Your values. Yes. Oh, mm, long lost. Oh, mate. It's big. So... Even without its electronic properties, it'll help me keep track of my keys. Because <laughs> it's sort of like tying a plate, and, like a kitchen plate to them. But it's like a two-part thing you download an app. No. Oh, mate. Well, if it's got an app, then I'm in. You know? I love it. I love apps. Who doesn't? Do you ever lose your keys? No, I have a place for everything. Like, my wallet goes in a certain spot when I come through the door. Yeah. My keys go in a certain Same spot. Here. Those basic essentials. And if they're not there, I freak out. I feel like with the phone, especially these days, you know, people are um, umbilically attached to their phones in all sorts of ways. I think you've got to keep it on you the whole time. It's got to be in the mm. pocket or in a, you know, somehow. It's mm. just the easiest thing is just keep it on you. Mm-hmm. And so when my wife is running around saying, I don't know, have you seen my phone? I'm like... What was wrong with uh, keep it on you advice? You've got jeans, right? Pop it in the pocket there. You're not going to break it. My wife. My wife. When my (laughs) wife loses her phone, I say. And also when my wife loses her keys, I have no sympathy because I think, well, you should be like me. You should use the hook. Always use the hook. I must discuss this with my wife. I will. I will. I will discuss with my wife. (laughs) (laughs) Are you are you my wife? Are you my wife? <laughs> <laughs> Who is my wife? I he he was an robot. What does that mean? Like this robot comes up to you and says, "He was an robot." Sounds like a bad kids joke. He was an robot. Are you my <laughs> wife? <laughs> He was a robot. You was a robot. (laughs) You should use the hook for the key. That's why you lost your key. Where is my wife? Where is my wife? Are you my wife? He was a robot. Is this still Christmassy? (laughs) I don't know. (laughs) Hey, but it's been such a pleasure to be on the Adam Buxton podcast. Oh, mate, thanks so much for coming. Do you know what? Can I? Should we have a little honest uh, section? Should we have to? No. All right, no, go on, say something honest. I'll just look at these rebels. All right. I was going to say something honest. And hide behind the pop shield. For a... Oh, I got an orange one. A period of time after we stopped doing the Six Music Show, Mm. I felt like I didn't want to have you on as a guest because it would be too much like... Too good. Saying to... Well, in a way. Mm. It would be too much like saying to people, yeah, we might carry on doing the Adam and Joe thing, and but I don't know. And I just wanted to have a clear cutoff, you know, and just say, no, we're not doing that anymore. 